Mars, what's your problem? I'm having an issue, like, emotionally connecting with my 10-year-old sister. Is it the age that's a problem? Like, you don't know how to relate to, like, a 10-year-old? Oh my gosh, how the hell do you relate to a 10-year-old? Like, that's so hard. Call from Mars. Mars? Mars? Hi. <laughs> how are Mars? you, Mars? Is that your name? Um, it's short for something else, but I really like Nar Mars. I think it's cool. Yeah, because it's like the, um, the planet. Is it short for, uh, not, the, not to, you know, put you on blast here, is it short for Marissa? <laughs> no, oh my gosh, that name sounds horrific. <laughs> Why come up? What, 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 wow! Is your, what is if your name for? is Marissa, put in the chat that your name is Marissa, because this girl so just you. obliterated you. Damn! What, what um, is I it? have a friend named Marissa. Marissa, if you're watching, shout out to you. So, that's cool. Um, Mars, what's your problem? I'm having an issue, like emotionally connecting with my ten-year-old. Mm, a sibling problem. A sibling problem. We, Very we, we, we could maybe How help. old are you? I'm 23. You know, mm. we, that's that's interesting because we never really had to deal with. We're not that far apart in age. What what do you, no. What do you? What's the problem? Is like you can't. Is it the age that's a problem? Like you don't know how to relate to like a 10 year old. Oh my gosh! How the hell do you relate to a 10 year old? Like that's so hard. Well, you're not going to relate to your 10-year-old sister, sister, right? As, like, a person yet. But, like, I think that you just have to, at this point, you just have to put yourself in the mind of a 10-year-old. Like, what did you, throughout your life, because you're older, you're going to have to put yourself in the situation that you were at her age. Mm. So you were 10. What do you like to do when you're 10? Mm. What did you like to do when you were 10, Lyle? I, I like think it's when funny. I was 10. Oh my God, well, uh, what did you like to do when you were 10? Yeah, what did you like to do when you were 10? Oh, I was well, too loud. Oh, your mic is all on me. Like, well, you said play video games and like, so like she's 10 years old, okay. She really likes like Roblox. And when I was 10, like I loved MMOs. Like that's all I would do with myself. Like I would play Maple Story for hours. Mm. And like, she that? does the same thing with Roblox. And like, I... For some reason, I can't relate anymore. Like, I just can't relate to that. H have you tried playing Roblox with her? I've told her that I would make an account, but I've also said in the same, like, voice that I would just do it to troll her, and that's kind of mean. That is mean. She's only 10. She doesn't really understand what trolling means. <laughs> oh, no. She See, you, knows, you're, you're, I'm going to put you on blast. You're kind of part of the problem. You can't try to relate to her with something she likes and then be like, oh, by the way, I'm going to make this experience miserable well, I, for you. Look, well, on the other side, look, Mars, I think, oh you God. know, look, to balance out what my sister said. <laughs> Sorry, I'm I think, honest. I think, uh, maybe you're, you're prepared. Look, there's undeniably there's trolls out there in the world. There's trolls in the Roblox world and maybe you're just sort of oh like God, buffing yeah. her up. At least she's being trolled by someone she loves, you know, before she, she gets trolled by someone out in the, the wild. Too. Like she's ruthless on the internet. Like I've like seen like the way she talks to her friends. And I'm Ooh. just like, mm. Oh, so maybe she'd appreciate What that. have you observed about the way that she talks to her friends? She likes to be edgy or she tries to be edgy, which is pretty much just like homophobic <laughs> and racist. Um, oh. and don't do that. Like that's really, that's not how it's supposed to be. Like you have to have manners on the internet. But she's at that age where like, they would like the schools would teach kids about internet etiquette. And mm, I can't do it. Wow. Really? Schools are teaching kids about internet etiquette now? That doesn't surprise me though. I mean, when I was, I mean, they did not teach us anything about that shit. That's what I had learned. I mean, like, I'm from 98, though. And so, like, I was in, she was in probably, like, third grade. I don't know what year I would have been in, like, third grade. <laughs> um, I, yeah, when it comes to being edgy and seeing edginess as being homophobic and racist, um, you know what? This is actually a great opportunity for you to bond with your 
sister and maybe um, teach her some lessons about how to be more kind and respectful and um, loving in the world because the energy you put out into the world is the energy you get back and if she's putting out that energy she's not gonna get that back I'll tell you that now I find that interesting that she's a troll because like when I think like because I know like 14 year old boys are like you know edgy assholes but I, I, I never like thought of like a li little girls going on the computer and like s s fucking trolling um yeah. I can't say that because I was one of those little girls it runs in the family! Ah, yeah, now we do you know. think she learned it from you? I think she's learned a lot from me, but all the wrong things. Damn. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, so your problem... So you were... <laughs> so you're the problem. Maybe you could bond over being trolls. I'm the toxic one. Oh, well. Mm. I, I love um, how do you bond though. with your sister? You know what? You both... You take you take this as a learning moment for both of you, and maybe you go to like um, internet class together. Some sort of like there, there's got to be like a trolls anonymous thing that you guys could attend together to like learn how to be less edgy on the internet. Okay, that um, sounds cool. Yeah, I think I think yeah, I agree with my brother on this one. Well, Mars. Listen, good luck to your sister. Good luck, good luck to, to you. you. And uh, I hope that you uh, eventually find Jesus Christ. No. <laughs> I hope that you find happiness and love in whatever secular way you fi you feel. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. <laughs> you have a good night, Mars. Bye, Mars. Good night.